Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Life of Wonders, welcome back to my channel. As you know, my name is Polo and I love making videos of dolls, toys and Disney collectibles. So, if you like this kind of content and you feel like supporting the channel, I always invite you all to subscribe to it. And that way, you will not be missing out on any of my future videos in which I will be showcasing new releases, past releases, all sorts of things that relate to dolls, toys and Disney. Uh, so today we're going to be having a close look at this iconic couple. This is the uh, Dream Glow uh, couple from 1985, released by Mattel. So we have the Dream Glow Barbie and the Dream Glow Ken. Um, there are a few things missing because, again, um, how many years? Oh my goodness, it's been... A few decades already since their release but mainly um they are intact especially their outfits which i believe is the most important thing for them um so and i'm super happy because um i mean you might think that they're not as special but they're super super special they have this element um with you know that was very very 80s um and their outfits especially has is covered in stars that um will glow in the dark um i mean if exposed to direct um light and then being in the dark of course and then the same happened um the very same happens for him uh but just around the vest but i love this outfit so very much for ken and i love that ken and that ken actually has this sculpt that then um that it was used for the toy story um franchise uh to uh to include barbie as and ken as part of their pixar movies uh so that's pretty uh pretty unique the thing that they're missing though um uh, are well um for barbie the earrings and the little ring and for him he's actually missing the white shoes but other than that again they're in pretty good condition um so starting with barbie here she's got a really really nice um you know pretty looking superstar face uh and super long blonde like uh bleached blonde um hair and it's parted in the middle here and then uh, that is how she was presented and then we have this gorgeous gown that is like the princess attempt back in the 80s the piece that i love most is like this stole or shawl um that is uh wrapped around and then it has a little snap on the back like so and then it has so many ruffles and trims and all that. And everything, as you can see, is covered in these stars that, um, you know, they might be a little bit... I mean, the, the dress is one piece and then we have this other piece. Um, and these stars are fragile, so I wouldn't recommend to wash it, probably. Or if you wash it, just do it so incredibly carefully because they will disintegrate easily and same when cleaning uh barbie in fact as you see um she's not like in perfect condition but i really um during this time um they painted it um you know it was not screen as such it was painted um and if you apply it and depending on the pressure you could actually erase the painting so that's why they're very fragile in those terms i believe she comes with her shoes which are these palms uh classic palms from the 80s which are a little bit thinner than the palms from the 90s um and so the dress is just so beautiful i will show you i will try to charge it with like light and then i will show you uh let's see if the camera can catch the glow in the dark sort of feature so it has these bodies that it's made out of this velvety material in a really shade of uh, really cute shade of pink and then this trim with like silver thread all around and then the dress itself has two layers there's this one that's translucent like an organza sort of layer chiffon um, and then these uh, lace is just um, attached through this cat and then there's this other very rather soft layer as well um, that adds to the um, 
you know, the volume and the princess uh, sort of like take. I do have other fashions that come from the same uh, Dream Glow line. Uh, so I will be showcasing that in the future as well. Um, and here we have Ken and he looks so cool. So, so cool. So as I was saying, this is the face coat that they use in even the same um, hair color that we could uh, see him sporting um, in the Toy Story movies. Um, so basically, Basically, the outfit is two pieces, so um, this is like a onesie um, all together, I think. I think so, as you can see, it's connected. Um, so it's like a onesie for the shirt, the vest that will also have these stars, but this time uh, they are stickers uh, just, you know, put on top. I love that the vest and the little... Um, and the little tie um, are pink because, I mean, not only uh, they match Barbie's outfit, but it looks also, it pops out super cool. Uh, so these are the tie. I don't, I, is it? I don't know, probably just like a pattern for the shirt. And then the color is like made out of plastic. Um, the ribbon tie thing is made out of fabric and then we have the vest that is like uh, this uh, velvety material but it's also very fragile and I wouldn't I wouldn't try to I, again submerge this into water because these stickers are going to are going to just uh, separate completely and then it, it has this uh, tuxedo this suit I put it like that so we could appreciate uh, the um, the interior part like the vest and the shirt but obviously it has a snap that can be closed there it even has a um, handkerchief um, that it, it has like the same sort of like material that we can find for the Barbie's outfit lay, um, yeah, trim or, or lace and then um, so he's basically having these socks that actually from a distance they look like shoes uh, but he was wearing I believe white shoes and I must have them but I really don't know where they are right now um, so super cool I mean super cool i love them um what i will do just now is just try to uh again charge them with light and then probably just take all the light in from the room and let's see if the camera ca can catch the uh, gimmick of the dream glow um thing for you to appreciate well, and here you can appreciate it a little bit. Uh, it glows so much more uh, than it shows on camera, um, but then it doesn't last uh, a long time. So anyway, but you have the whole picture now, as you can see, it's fading away. Uh, but uh, right after it's exposed to light, it lasts for a few seconds and it's all around. So it's pretty magical. Um, and this is the review so far. I know it's dark, <laughs> but uh, well, I hope you've enjoyed it. And if you have, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. I will be super happy to get back to all your comments. And for now, stay safe and I'll see you all very, very soon.